I'm glad I'm married. I love being married, equally hated being single. I was not good at being single. Hard to meet women when your pickup line includes an apology and a Star Wars quote. <laughs> and insecure and broke is one thing. Insecure, broke, and single, that's the frosting on the loser cake. <laughs> I did this one time, this is true, when I was single. I'm in the bank, I'm doing the transaction. I ask the teller out. And then I realize I just asked someone out who's looking at a computer view of my financial situation. <laughs> there is nothing you can say at that very moment. Just, I've got other accounts. There's one I keep negative. <laughs> my wife is great. My wife's from Texas. I married a Texan. And uh, I remember when I proposed to her, I told her I'm from Hawaii and I sure would love to stay in this country. So. <laughs> Life is great. We've been married 16 years. Uh, but, oh, thank you. That's very nice. Yeah. That is very nice of you, but we've been together 23. I have to say that because she wants credit for time served. <laughs> married or not, been together a long time, 23 years. And we met in a bar because 23 years ago, pretty much what you had to do. We didn't have your texting and your match.com. You had to be rejected face to face. <laughs> then you had to walk away in your Jedi robe. That sucked. <laughs> no, you do want to dance. These aren't the dorks you're looking for. <laughs> you're a dork. <laughs> 23 years we've been together. I realized last year how long my wife and I have been together. We had a power outage in our neighborhood one night and we're looking out the window, everything. Street lights out, every house, the whole neighborhood is pitch black and I hear my wife's voice say this. So, did you pay the bill? <laughs> No, I made them so mad, they went, you know what, shut the whole town down. I hate that guy. <laughs> hey, I realize she's half joking, but that still means half her brain went, you know, it could have been him. <laughs> 23 years we've been together. My wife and I have been together so long that she could be mad at me, and I could not know why and I'm cool with that. Because <laughs> I've learned that knowing doesn't help at all. I don't know what causes a hurricane, but I do know when it's time to hide in the bathroom. I know that part. She was mad at me in the morning one time. I just woke up. What could I have done? I'm not kidding. I wake up, I walk out, I sit down. Oh, I can't believe you know, because you were just talking about something I was going to say, and then you were just like, I Are you mad at me? Well, yes, I am. Here comes a rookie mistake. Why? <laughs> right? I asked. Here's why she was mad at me, and I'm not making this up. My wife was mad at me. Because I cheated on her in her dream. <laughs> yep, you ever took a test where there were no correct answers? I did. <laughs> There's nothing you can do. You just sit there and hope for a UFO abduction. That's all you got. I can't believe you did that. Well, I didn't do that. Oh, yes, you did. 
you had a penguin head and a reggae hat, but I knew it was you the whole time. So I did the only thing I could think to do. I went back to sleep and apologized to her in my dream. So. Subscribe to Drybar Comedy for even more of the world's largest collection of clean comedy.